Hello friends, in this video we will learn that how we can burn bootload our 80 mega IC. So see this video till end, let's get started. Friends, most of us make a temporary hardware for bootload our 80 mega IC. But this procedure only works fine if we need to do bootload for 2 to 3 ICs. So for bootload many ICs in few seconds, I make a small PCV, this one, in this PCV. There is a zip socket. This is this zip socket which we need to attach our new IC every time. And here is a master IC from which the new IC get bootloaded. Friends, an interesting part is this that for bootloading an IC, we didn't need any laptop or PC or mobile phone because in this PCV, the master IC works for bootloading the new IC. The procedure is very easy. First of all, we need to put our new IC in this zip socket. Our new ICs. This one. This zip socket is of 40 pin. You can also use the 28 pin zip socket. So, this one is the pin number 1 of our IC so let's attach our IC like this and just lock this zip socket just like this now just we need to give the 12 volt power to, to this circuit board this is a normal power supply of 12 volt black one is ground and red one is positive now let's on the power you can see here the red LED which is the power indication now for bootloading our IC just we need to push this button after pushing this button these LEDs are ready to flicking which means our new IC get boot loaded let's see again with another IC Now our second IC is also uploaded in just one second. done now our all four ICs get bootloaded in just one to two seconds by using this circuit board friends the important thing is when there is some error at the time of bootloading then these LEDs does not flicker which means our IC has some defect for example IC is not fitted in zip socket or IC has different pin numbers let's check here I am having some damaged IC some damaged 80 mega 328 IC which is not working properly so when we put this IC in zip socket and push this button so only one LED is blinking which means our IC has some defect or our IC is damaged
let's see with this also only one led but when we put the right led right ic means the perfect ic in zip socket then all leds are flickering and burn loaded also so there is an advantage of these leds that we will be notified when the ic has done boot load it friends from this board you can boot load 80 mega 8 80 mega 168 and 80 mega 328 ic's if you want any more information then whatsapp us whatsapp number is given in description box now let's see that how this pcb had been made at home first we need to make a diagram of connections between our zip socket and master ic and some components this is the diagram then make a print out and paste it on a copper plate after paste print out on copper plate using some water and heating now we need to remove that paper just like a tattoo printing now for removing extra copper except connection we need a chemical name as ferric chloride here in this pcb the components are justified just like this this is push button they are the capacitors these are the leds with 1k resistors this is diode and voltage regulator negative positive terminal this crystal pf and resistance for this ic this crystal pf and resistance for the zip socket So the diagram is very simple. If you like my video, then subscribe my channel, like and share. Thank you.